I have been very intrigued at the thought of getting veggie burgers. There's been this place that has been around here for a while called Muse, and everybody's talking about it. Everybody's talking about how nice and delicious the food is, and so I decided to go ahead and get some for me today. Wait, hang on. There, there's the label. I was very confused with the menu because I'm not used to a simplified menu compared to everywhere else. Everywhere else has a menu that has like 40 different items on it that you had to have to read in order to figure out what you want. But over here, it was just like, okay, here's this basic ingredients done. So let's take a look at this food here. First off in this box, since it's already right here, I got very sticky ketchup. Don't ask me why the ketchup is sticky. I have no idea. Next up, we have, oh, actually it's in a little basket. We have a small basket of fries, and then we have the delicious burger with a french fry in it. Fries are pretty good. I got the basic sea salt fries, so I mean, it's kind of hard to go wrong there. Nice, hot, and fresh. All right, so the main attraction is this burger. Let's take a look at this. Let's go ahead and pull this out of the little sleeve here. All right, so if we can look here, we got the basic fake patty, the ve veggie patty. I also got the one with jalapenos and the famous Muse sauce. If I'm gonna try it, I might as well try their sauce. Got the pickles, got uh, regular, oh, it's got regular and grilled onions on it. I'm glad they did that. I was trying to figure out how to read the menu because I had no idea how to read the menu, even though it's very simplified. And I was just like, uh, let's just get all the veggies on it. Uh, and I realized that I had to read off all the vegetables. I was like, oh, that's fine, I'll take it. It's a very thick, oh, it's not even, not even open over here. Very thick morsel. And my mouth is watering just looking at it. So let's go ahead and try it. For some reason, it tastes like that they also had it on the grill with like regular burgers. <laughs> fresh jalapenos, fresh lettuce. God, that lettuce is green as hell. Look at that. Mmm, love having the green lettuce. You know, like whenever you go to those places and like the lettuce isn't bad, but it's like just enough yellow where it's just like, I don't want to try that. I don't want to eat that. That's what I get from some of these places. I would probably mess with this a lot more than I would that Sonic burger that I tried the other day. The Sonic Smasher was okay, but I will say this is a hundred times better. How much does it all cost? Well, for this veggie burger with all the veggies on it and this thing of fries and the drink, 1968. Yeah, it was $19.68 for this. I could have got a meal for half the price, but then again, you can never tell if the meal that's worth half the price is actually good or not. This is worth it, but goddamn, it's expensive. Fry in the ketchup. Mm -mm -mm. I will give this a nine out of 10. Honestly, I would go back to Muse again. If you're ever looking around and you happen to have a Muse place near you, make sure to stop on in. Get the veggie burger. I want to see veggie burgers with all of the veggies on it. I don't think I'm going to see it, but I, I would like to see it. You ready? Yeah. Got everything on. Oh, beer coverings. Oh, yeah, uh, yes. All right, here we go. Awesome. Here we go. Three and a half. very nice and cool evening isn't it rocky he's so happy we're supposedly getting some storms at some point 
and things are getting a lot cooler. The first day of fall officially is on September 22nd, but it's already feeling like it's fall weather and it's been kind of getting that way anyway. And considering that this park next to my house has not been busy <laughs> because of this, the tornado that we had, it's nice and peaceful and cool out. And I decided that tonight I really needed to get on a walk before going back to work tomorrow. I do also want to say I'm very appreciative of everyone being cool with watching these videos. I know that vlogging anymore is cringe and I know that not a lot of people like to see it unless there's just something interesting happening. Whenever I have been doing stuff on the computer as of the last few years, I have only been on the computer or just doing something at the house or doing something at work. I never actually went outside and did stuff for me or did stuff that, you know, would be a little more productive and a little more, you know, movie than just sitting at the computer all day just playing video games. I would just stay at home and just not do anything and always have my eyes glued onto the computer screen and then I did deliveries and then I definitely had more time to look at the computer screen. And I just realized that it was something that I needed to change. I've been going to the gym now. I've got a normal nine to five job. Well, I mean, hours may vary, but I have a normal job. I'm doing okay. There's a lot of things that stress me out, especially as of right now, but I think I'm doing okay. And I think I'm going to try to do more whenever it gets much colder, especially because we're coming on to, you know, winter is coming up, more holidays are coming up, the big ones. We got Thanksgiving, we got Christmas, like we, we've got all sorts of stuff going on now. Now I have to, you know, make room for those videos whenever I decide to do them. <laughs> I do know that I want to at least do something kind of calming and relaxing for a Thanksgiving video. Something hopefully calm and relaxing for a Christmas video. I could tell you right now, those two holidays are going to be hard as hell to have things done. I'm going to be pushing myself over my limit. Boy, if you get into the water, you're gonna have to stay outside for a while. Guess who gets to stay outside for a while? Shouldn't drink the water that quick. I don't know if the microphone is picking it up. There's this dude who's been flying a plane over my house for the last few nights. And I've been trying to figure it out if like, if there's a helicopter that's going by or if it's a plane and I'm hearing it now and he's like doing free falls and spins and shit up there. I, I, I wanna try and get a better view of it, but I don't know if I'm going to. It's, it's a very interesting sight. I just looked up and the dude's just doing spins and shit. dry now this is how he sleeps with me every night he's a good boy i think it's time for me to go to sleep for tonight they got a fight something else to do they got a fight something else to do all right good night I guess this area, the flies really like to mess around with my face because they've been swarming my face since I got out here. Jesus Christ. Stop it. <laughs> Knock it off.
this trail just keeps getting sketchier and sketchier. Jesus Christ. Ugh. And it's all like leaning this way. So it seems like that you're gonna just like fall down the mountain or something. What the fuck is this? You gotta go all the way around and then just straight down. What the hell? Now I gotta make this long trek all the way up this hill back to the car. Whew, what a walk this was. My legs are so tired, dude, Jesus Christ. There's my baby. You wanna talk about a walk? That was a goddamn walk, holy hell. I've been wanting to go over to this trail for a while, but every time I would come over here, there's always just too many people and I wanna be able to stop whenever I want to, you know, take some B-roll videos or pictures and stuff and make the video look cool. But there was always people. Now there's not very many people because people are going back to school and work and shit. And now it's a little more pleasant out here. If you guys want to accomplish something for the rest of this year, get out and go on walks or hikes or something because I am trying to do that to keep myself, you know, motivated to move and get my steps in and stuff like that. And it's also really good to do that because the more I've been just, you know, idle in my chair, it's going to end up killing me in the process. So I would definitely recommend going on a run, walk, hike, whatever it is that you want to do. I have one other person that I'm trying to convince them to keep going on more hikes and stuff because we did one one time and then I outwalked them. So... Yeah, I'm I'm pretty I'm pretty good at doing this stuff. Well, it's really freaking cold out now. Had to bust out the hoodie. Summer's pretty well over, so uh, summer vlogs are pretty well done. Um, I may end up going and I don't know doing some more exploring and stuff like that. But summer vlogs like swimming in the lake and having t-shirts and sunglasses and shorts and flip flippy floppies and all that stuff like that's basically done at this point. So yeah now I'm just going to prep for the cold. I don't think I'm going to be recording any more vlog like stuff for a little while. I don't know if I'm going to be doing anything for Halloween so maybe I'll do like a Halloween vlog or something. I don't know but for those of you who do like the vlogs right now, I'm going to take a little break from them. Well, there's nothing that's going on right now anyway. It's only September. It's already cold. Brrr.